My name is Mike Hobbs and in this video I want to show you how to create a rotator link using the tool called Click Magic with a K at the end. And the reason I want to show you with this tool is because this is a actual personal tool that I use to uh, create my own rotator URLs for my team because uh, I actually have been having this question from multiple people on how to create a rotator you know, between other people. So let's say you're running like a, a solo ad for people or maybe you have a team co-op where you wanna drive traffic to maybe 10 different people from your own personal marketing and you wanna rotate that traffic between the 10 people, then this is the tool to use. Uh, and one thing that I have made a commitment to do on this channel is only recommend tools that I personally use. I don't uh, recommend tools that I don't actually personally use. So yes, this is a paid tool and I am an affiliate of it, but I will never join an affiliate program just to make money from a tool. If I'm personally using it, I usually sign up as an affiliate just so that I can you know, monetize the tools that I'm personally using in my own business to, to run my own business. So if you'd like to support the channel, in the description of the video, I'll have a link to pick up Click Magic if this is a tool you feel you want to use for your rotators. So why am I using this tool for the rotators? And I'm going to walk you through actually creating one. The, the main reason is because there's probably some out there that are probably free, right? You might be able to find some out there that are free uh, that will rotate between the 10 people. But there's a few things on this tool that I really like and why I choose to use this for my rotators. The first thing is you can go and you can check out the traffic quality. So, you know, when you're sending traffic to your rotator, you click on this little wrench, click on traffic quality, and you can see the quality of the traffic that's being sent to that URL. So you can see, okay, there's tier one clicks. That means, you know, the top five countries in the world, English speaking and all that stuff. And then there's tier two, tier three. So you can kind of see the breakdown on the traffic quality. But here's a big one that I really love, is you can see how many mobile clicks there are. And this will actually allow you, so if you're getting 77% of people clicking on your links through mobile device, you know that you should probably uh, make your, your website mobile friendly and, and really focus more on the mobile version of your website than the desktop version because more people are seeing the mobile version of your website. So that's just another little tip and, and knowing the, the quality of your traffic is huge when it comes to marketing. So you can kind of see that. So that's one really big thing. Another big thing that I like about this rotator is the settings that it gives you, like the ability to do different things with your rotator. Like for example, you can put tracking pixels on your actual link versus having to put it inside of your pages. And this is perfect for, uh, you know, track for, for like rotators that you don't control their website. You might have 10 different websites that you have no control over. Well, you can still add retargeting pixels, any kind of pixel to the actual rotator link, which will, will actually trigger those pixels when you get visitors from to that page. You know, you can, you can send out emails, you can, you know, have a different version for the mobile version versus the iOS right version. There's geo-targeting, so you can set the rotator to go only to certain countries, like only allow clicks from certain countries. Uh, there's different filters, there's different uh, settings that you can do that a normal free rotator wouldn't do. But one of my favorite settings, and this is my all-time favorite settings for my rotator, is most of those other rotators They'll just deliver your traffic one by one by one by one by one. And, and if a repeat visitor hits the URL, it'll just go to the next person. So that ends up being, you know, the, the, the repeat visitors end up opting in to multiple pages sometimes when you do that. So what I like to do is there's a rotator mode here. There's four different modes. You can read about the different modes by clicking this little question mark. So I'm not gonna go into that in this video, but my favorite mode is sequential, which means each visitor will go down the line in order, right? Uh, but there's the biggest thing right here is you can set it to same URL, the repeat visitors. 
So someone who clicks on your link from a marketing campaign goes to one person. If he clicks on that same link again, it'll go to the same person over and over and over and over. This is huge because this allows you to, you know, rotate traffic and only give unique visitors to your other people in the rotator and repeat visitors will go to the same person. So it's, it's kind of like uh, giving guaranteed traffic to someone. So I like that uh, right there. So anyway, let's go ahead and create a rotator. So how you do it is you click on rotators at the top, you click on create a new rotator, you name it. So we'll just name it team uh, rotator. Okay. Uh, now there's also, if you go through the different, maybe in a different video, I'll show you how to do a, a, a custom domain if you'd like. I recommend using a custom domain, but uh, like, so I have one right here that I can use, but uh, if you want to just use their default one, you can use their default one that they give you. That's totally fine. Uh, but you know, I definitely recommend doing a custom domain. They have training on it, so you can go through their training under learn and set up a custom domain yourself. Uh, maybe a future video as well. So anyway, we're just going to go, I'm going to type in team rotator three, right? Uh, that's just the URL that it's going to go to. And then right here, sequential mode, same URL backup. So this is actually just a backup website. If let's say the, the rotator URL, maybe one of their links went down or maybe their server is having issues, it'll send them to a backup a backup URL. So this is, this is a site that you want them to go to if one of the URLs in your rotator doesn't work. Okay. So that's what I'm going to do there. And I'm going to go ahead and click on create rotator. And now once the rotator is created, you go click on it and you will see the URL of that rotator. So this is the URL you're going to use in all of your marketing. When you're driving traffic, you're going to send everyone here, and then you're going to, then what you're going to do is you're going to add URLs to this rotator. So what you'll do is click on this little wrench and click add URL. Okay. And then let's say Billy Bob. Okay. Let's send, so you'll get his rotator link. So his capture page, wherever you're sending the traffic to. So let's say you're sending it to google.com. That's his URL. Okay. We'll click add. Um, let's go back and then go find the rotator again. You can click on the wrench again and click add URL. And this time we'll do Sally Sue and she's going to go to yahoo.com and then add rotator. Let's add one more. So let's go over there to, so you can click on the, the two of two here and that'll also pull it open. But uh, then you right click on this or just click on this uh, left click I mean, on this little wrench again, click add URL. Okay. And then this one will be John Doe and we'll send to facebook.com. Now I also want to point out there's a lot of other settings you can do on the individual URLs as well. So like, for example, let's say you promise someone 300 clicks. You can just type in 300 clicks here. That'll then once 300 clicks are fulfilled, it'll pause that person's campaign and then it'll just fulfill the rest of the people. So that's kind of cool. Or you can even daily maxes. You can leave these blank. You can give some bonus percentages. So let's say you offered a 20% bonus. You can give those. Um, but another really amazing feature is if let's say you're doing a, a rotator and you promise someone 300 clicks, well, you can actually, uh, go over to notify and then it's, you can set this to yes. And then you can notify them once their 300 clicks have fulfilled. So you can put their email in right here. So that's kind of a cool little feature as well. So if you guys are selling solo ads or, or rotator clicks or something like that, this is a really cool feature, but yeah, so you can also put tracking pixels on individual URLs as well. So not just the main URL, the main rotator, but the individual URLs, you can put tracking pixels on those as well. So yeah, there's lots of cool settings that you cannot do with free rotators out there. Uh, that's why I choose to use this version click of click magic, the paid version. And uh, let's go ahead and add this third URL. So now we have three URLs. So here's how it's going to work. 
So I'm going to go ahead and click on edit, edit rotator. Okay. And here's how this works. I'm going to go ahead and set it to next URL for right now. So you can see how it rotates between them. Cause if I set it the same, then I won't rotate it. So let me go ahead and click save and let me show you the two different ways that it goes. So let's click on uh, the actual rotator. Let's grab our marketing link. So now when you go out there and you start marketing, and someone clicks on this link, here's what will happen. It'll go to Google, right? It'll go to the first URL in the thing. Now let's say they go to the, someone else goes to the link. Then look, it goes to Yahoo. Then someone else goes to the link. It goes to Facebook, right? So you can basically send this. And then as they keep going, it just rotates back to Google back to Yahoo. Basically, if you have 10 people in the rotator, it's going to rotate between all 10. Now, here's the thing that I really love about this rotator is you can set it to same URL. So now if the same person clicks on the same link, they'll go to the same person. So let me change that and let me show you what that looks like. So now I go here and I go to Facebook, right? But now check this out. I'm going to go to it again. And look, Facebook. And if I go to it again, Facebook. So basically, when you set it to same URL, it now allows you to send repeat visitors to the same person over and over and over and over. So if the same person is clicking the link, it goes to the same person. That way, you know, I've actually seen this happen in some marketing campaigns where one person will go to an email, they'll click on a link, go to Billy Bob, right? And opt into his website and then forget to finish and follow through. And then later on, you know, go back to that same email, click on the link, and then they go to Sally Sue and then they opt into that person's list too. So now this person's on multiple people's lists and it's just confusing. And it's, it's kind of like selling one click to two different people, the same click. I don't like that. You know, it's, it's, it's delivering the same click to multiple people. Some people go back to the same link four, five, ten different times, you know? So that's like giving one click to 10 different people. I think the same visitor should go to the same person. So it doesn't, you know, track clicks for everyone. So that's just kind of how I run my rotators and co-ops. And that's a really cool feature that you can do. So that's how you use this rotator. It's really, really amazing. There's lots, like you can go back here, play around with it. There's lots of other settings. Like, like one of the things we didn't really talk about was this, uh, the rotator mode. There's four different modes and you can, like I said, you can click this little thing and it'll have some articles walking you through the different, through the different modes. But yeah, click magic is, is, is $27 a month. That's the, the one that you need. You don't need any of these other ones. Uh, because you get unlimited conversions, all these different, co all the core features, everything you need. And then, you know, as your traffic goes up, then you may need to upgrade to some of the other versions. But the 27 is, is perfectly fine. Uh, I'll have a link in the description if you want to try it out. I think it's free for 14 days, as you can see. At least at the time of this video, it's free for 14 days. Try it out. If you like it, keep it. If you don't, cancel it. But I use it not only for my rotators, but I also use it for my actual tracking of links out there on the internet. So with that being said, if you have any questions, feel free to, to comment below and let me know. And if you got value from this video, subscribe to the channel. I like to do tech reviews like this and, and help entrepreneurs market their business better on the internet. And I'll have all the resources in the description of everything that you need, especially to get this tool. There'll be a link in the description as well to get the tool if you want to use it. And again, comment below, give me a like, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.